Hello, welcome to my channel. Um, I got something weighing on my mind real heavy about my stepmother. May she rest in peace. Now it's bothering me about her. And I did call her mother. I called her mom. Mama. So, anyway, she got cancer and died rather slowly. But she did write a will. And I do know my dad can see writing when he wants to. When my father wants to see the written word, he can. He can play cards. He can see the cards. Okay, I'm just saying, if he wants to see something, he has a pinpoint of vision where he can see. Anyway, so she wrote a will, and I saw it. She had specifically made wishes about specific things that were easy to follow wishes where she wanted each piece of jewelry she owned to go her car yep and her car she wanted me to have her car. And my dad couldn't sell it. He could not get rid of it fast enough. After she died, he unloaded that for, I think, 10000 15 I don't know. It was a very expensive car. And very hard to obtain now because it had all the extras on it. She had heated seats, sunroof, everything you could ask for. She loved that car. And she had me sit in the passenger seat and she showed me everything and she was so proud of that car. And I know now that I look back in her mind exactly what she was thinking. And I love her for that. My father barely honored her jewelry wishes, barely. He said he couldn't find her jewelry at first. Okay, maybe he was being hard hit by his wife's death, but I know my father and stuff does not get misplaced around him. Now, first he blamed the care workers. Then he came back and said, no, I found it. I guess she had put everything in a box. Maybe towards the end she thought, she thought to hide it probably, yeah. Anyway, so, see I can figure things out. So anyway, so he did that kind of grudgingly from what I can see, what I can see now. And I just think it's rather sick for him to get rid of her car right away like that when she wanted her stepdaughter to have it. Clearly, um, yeah, and I just think it's very odd that my father would not honor his dead wife's wishes for his live daughter's benefit I am his daughter and I am alive and he just glossed right over that and sold the car why because I have a car why can't I have two cars my husband does I certainly could have two cars that wouldn't hurt nothing But everybody thought better of it and thought for me and well that's what happens I guess 
I'm going to get emotional now. i got to go. I said my peace. Peace out.